Hello and welcome to Quick Tips, the Filmora video editing series. In this video, we will see how to create cinematic trailer using Filmora 11. There are many preset templates that you can use to create cinematic trailer in Filmora 11. Now let me show you some sample videos that I have created using cinematic trailer. So this is the first sample. So in this cinematic trailer, I have used one of the preset template and I have made some changes to that template and I used my own videos and title in that preset template. Now let's play the next one. Let's play the next one. So this was the small one. So as I said, there are many preset templates that you can use to create cinematic trailer. So let's see how we can use the preset templates and create cinematic trailer in Filmora 11. Do not forget to subscribe to Quick Tips YouTube channel. Watch new videos about website design, e-commerce websites, search engine optimization, social media marketing, WordPress tutorials, video editing tips and many more. Press the bell icon to get instant notification whenever we publish new videos. So here I am on the dashboard of the Filmora and I am using Filmora 11. Now in this video we are going to create the cinematic trailer using Filmora 11. So I am on the dashboard and here I am on the media tab and under media you will see preset templates click on it so cinematic trailers is a part of preset templates now under templates you will see this option cinematic click on cinematic and here you will see many different preset templates i have already downloaded some of these templates and i'm going to create some videos using these templates and i'll show you how to change the preset template videos and images with your own videos all right so let's start with this So you can see that this is one of the unknown place trailer. Now let me show you how you can use this template. Click on it, drag it and drop it on the timeline. When you drop it on the timeline, you will see that all the elements, all the assets used in this particular preset template. So here you will see this is the audio. This is the sound effect. Uh, this is the background, I guess. Uh, let's see, this is also intro element. So here you will see different effects are used in this preset template. Now you will see some of these effects have this diamond icon like this. These media assets are the part of film stock. To use these assets or effects, you will need access to film stock. I already have subscription to the film stock so I can use these effects and these media assets. Now let's see, when I go to project media, I'll see all these videos and images used in this preset template. So I'm going to add my own video. I have already downloaded these stock videos from Pexels. So if you want to use the stock videos, you can also try Pexels. You will see it here, Pexels. You can download stock videos from Pexels. So I'm going to use, let's say this video here. You can see this video here. This is the video I'm going to replace this video with this one. So let's see, I'm going to drag it and drop it on this video itself. And when you release it, you will get the message replace or insert. Now we are going to replace this one. So click on replace and you will see that the video is replaced. Let me play it again. Now, if you want to change the text, you can simply go to this one and you will see the title here. You can change the title. It says above. You can change it to whatever you want. Let me change it to quick tips. Now, this is the title here. So, you will see different effects are already there. 
if you do not like any effect you can delete that effect and use your own effect so now let me export this video all right so the video has been exported now let's play the video All right, now let's delete all these files from here and we are going to use another one. Now let's go back to cinematic and I have downloaded one more, a small one. This is a cinematic galaxy trailer. Let's play this one. Let's drag it and drop it here. And you will see all the assets, the effects and videos used in this particular preset template. Now let's see here we have the audio. This is the sound effect I guess and this is the opener pack. Now here you will see the diamond icon also. So that means these packs are the part of film stock and you will need the access or the film stock subscription. Now here you can see this is the effect. I guess this is a video let's go to project media and this is the footage it has been used here this is the green screen I think in this preset template they have used the chroma effect so that's why it's showing the here you will see this so let's see I'm going to replace a video here with this one again so drag it and drop it on this video itself and click on replace and let's play it now here you will see that new video is there so here you can see the title also so let's see this is the title or you can click on it and change the title Right, so let me export this one also. All right, close this. All right, now let's try another one, a small one now. Go to cinematic and let's scroll down and let me see this one. This is very really short, short one. So use use this one. This is just an intro, I guess. So drag it and drop it on the timeline. Play it. So here you will see the text. I'm going to edit this text. Let's export it. So here you will see many different cinematic preset templates that you can use to create your own cinematic trailer effect using Filmora 11. So that's it for now. See you in the next video. Do not forget to subscribe to my channel to get more quick tips about online softwares and tools. If you have any questions, please leave us message in comments section and press the like button if you like the video. Thanks for watching quick tips.